All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today I'm going to be talking to you about where Minecraft saves all of your different uh, saved games or worlds when you play locally on your computer. It's a little bit different when you do it on a server, but there's usually just a folder of the same name as your world that you can just copy to your desktop and back up in the event that you're going to like try some crazy mods or you want to upload your copy of a world to a server somewhere, whatever, this will be how you find it. So for the Java edition, probably the easiest one to find is you just go into your launcher at the top here. You've got like play and installations and realms and skins and stuff. We just want to go to installations and then here under whatever version you're playing, you hover over it and you'll see there's play, a folder icon and some dots to open up another menu. We're going to click the folder icon to open up the installation location. And then over here, we have a, a little section underneath resource packs called saves. And so if we open up saves, here are my different worlds that I've created, my cool test world, my shader packs and my tutorial world, which just contain all the different data from like player info, to other, you know, saved stuff like the world itself. And I can just copy this and I can just paste this now, like on my desktop with all this other junk. And then I can now copy this wherever I, and then paste this, I don't know, like inside of my downloads folder for whatever reason, I can just paste a copy here. And now it's backed up if I want. Now, the Minecraft Windows version's a little bit more of a pain in the butt. We actually have to open up our app data folder. So I'm going to go down to my Windows search bar, type in percent app data percent and hit enter. And from here, I want to make sure I go back to my app data folder by going back one folder here at the top menu bar and clicking on local. And from here, I want to find packages, which is down at the bottom. It's everyone's favorite. So here under P, we should have packages. And then inside of here, we are looking for Minecraft dot or Microsoft dot Minecraft UWP. <coughs> and I wrote this on a sticky note. So, you know, I'm a serious uh, tutorial man. That's exactly what I'm going to claim. So here it is, Microsoft.Minecraft UWP. I'm going to open up that. And inside of here, we should have local state. And then games. Com.Mojang. And then Minecraft worlds. And here are my other worlds. These ones aren't labeled as nicely. But you can just literally copy all of these if you wanted to and then paste them somewhere else. Although you could probably tell which one is the one that you used most recently by sorting by date modified. And the my most recent was back in December on the 26th. I played at 630 in the evening with some friends. So this is my most recently used uh, map inside of Minecraft Windows Edition. So I could then, you know, see that this is all my goodies inside of here, and then I could back up, right click, copy, and then once again, like paste this in my downloads folder to do whatever I feel like, really. So yeah, that's it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. This has been a brief look at how to find your game saves inside of both Minecraft Java and Minecraft Bedrock Edition to make it easy to back up your game saves for whatever reason you need them for. Uh, I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Bye, everybody, and have a good one.